Okay. So we've got question number 19. And um, we've got a picture that's not drawn accurately. And it's of a uh, sector here. And calculate the sector OAB. So it gives us the information that's in the diagram. It says from O to A to B. So calculate the sector. Well, so therefore, we need to know some key points. So the area of a circle, as we know, is pi r squared, and we know that the circumference, oops, the circle is pi times diameter, which is 2 pi r. But if I want to find out, so this is obviously the one I want to work with the area, so I obviously want to work with this one, and not this one. So, to work out a sector, well that's just a fraction of a whole circle. So it's a fraction of a whole circle. So if I want to work out the area of OAB, well, it's the pi r squared, which is what I want, but I want to times it by a fraction. And the fraction I want is, oh, it's certainly not that, is 30 over 360. Because I want this section here and obviously, dodgily, that circle carries on all the way around there. So I want OAB is 30 over 360, which is actually 1 12th of the whole circle times pi r squared. So what I've got to work out is the area of the uh, circle is normal, and then divide it by 12, or times it by 1 12th. So 1 12th times pi, one important point, pi is roughly equal to, according to the according to the front of the exam paper, calculator button. Okay? So, times, in our case, whoops, it's going to be times 15 squared. And I'm going to use the calc I'm going to just type this all onto my calculator using the fraction button as well. So I've got one twelfth times pi times fifteen squared, and I end up with fifty-eight point nine zero which is approximately equal to, we want to round it to three significant figures, so it's 58.9 when I round it to three significant figures. Now I don't see this as any harder than a normal um, circle question. The same thing applies if I wanted just the arc. If I wanted the distance from here to here, that would just be a fraction, again in this case 30 over 360, times by uh, pi diameter. Okay, so if you wanted the arc, it works exactly the same. It's a fraction of, fraction multiplied by whatever you've got here.